Hello, hope everyone is doing great. Today's topic is actually a little bit complex one, okay? But uh, let me uh, try to put it in simple terms. It is nothing but being happy in life, right? And that's the whole purpose of uh, everybody here uh, living on this earth is to be happy. But uh, people have different, different uh, uh, expectations, uh, different way of living. So let me try to put it in my experience. Uh, how, what are the things that from my perspective, how we can uh, lead a happy life? Okay. So it is actually a very relative term. Okay. It varies from person to person. And uh, to me, being happy means I like to do what I like to do on a daily basis. Uh, wherever I want to go, I, I feel like I, want, I can go. Whatever I want to eat, I can do it. Um, whoever I want to spend time with, I can do it. So all these things put together uh, gives me happiness. Right. So for some, it is like time for some, it is like money for such some, it is like kind of a recognitions they're looking for, or it's a combination of all the above for some people or some for some, it is like shopping uh, for some, it is like eating. So it, it you know, it's just a different, different things. So it's a combination. So it's a combination of what it's a primary combination. It's a relationship, uh, time, money. Uh, health so you need to find out what really gives you that happiness okay so few tips from my end are stay excited all the time be curious in life about things um, have a big self-confidence in you have that confidence have that positive mindset towards life uh, give back to the society need not be a monetary thing that you're giving back it can be a time that you're giving back to the society uh, treat yourself uh, uh, let's say you had some goals uh, when you accomplish a goal treat yourself uh, accept yourself that who you are it can be physically it can be mentally accept who you are as a person let's put it in a few different aspects right from morning to night from uh, at your office how to be happy at your home how to be happy so let's let's think from a dis uh, different aspects on this so from morning to night right first thing is when you wake up don't rush okay say have some time for gratitude say like uh, thanks to god and then start your day just that that five seconds or ten seconds when you wake up just be calm and then start your day that will be so good okay maybe you can start with a few minutes of book reading first thing you know don't see your mobile that's the worst thing people do right don't do that and then uh, once you start your day have a calendar practice right you might think hey what is calendar man morning i wake up i go to office come back what is a calendar no you need to have a calendar for example you're paying some bills you're um, visiting some hospitals you know have a calendar as a practice so you know that day what is there that week what is there right maybe morning or evening go for some natural walk do some exercise little bit of an exercise I mean 15 20 minutes uh, meditation whatever right whatever is possible for you in your uh, environment do it set goals okay and uh, you be uh, you know be have the eager why we need to set goals because you will have something to look forward that's why you set goals okay and sleep rest properly like have that six to seven hours of good sleep that is really important okay this is something uh, you do from morning to night and then office so important right so how to be a uh, happy happy at office so see don't be over smart which means don't like hey i'm doing i'm doing great in this technology i know everything okay give me more work don't be so, so smart in that aspect okay um be very good you know take some good work finish it spend spend your uh, family time also that's that, that's why i'm saying that and then build true relationship build true friendships Okay, that's important. Have a very positive approach at workplace as well. It's a very common phenomena in having that positive mindset and uh, compliment others. Okay, you know, thank you whenever they do some help to you. Thank you. Okay, and uh, see, work hard. That is no choice, no options in that. Okay, you have to work hard. Be proactive at work. Uh, in any communications it can be email communications it can be a call or you know you want you need to meet some person in any work related be proactive in updating things okay and uh, don't compare yourself to others okay 
we say that to kids it applies to our, ourselves as well help your team members you know it can be in any work if you are done with your work you know help them you know be work work together right that's uh, avoid gossips it is not going to help anybody in life right do that and uh, next uh, area is being happy at home okay what i do right and uh, what i recommend is uh, spend some quality time um meaning have some specific time for tv or mobile okay uh, so have that kind of a culture created at home so you know you are not looking at tv you are not looking at your mobile phone and then talking to your family so you know keep this aside different things right i'm not saying don't watch tv or don't watch phone you know have that specific time for all that right because from morning to night right you always work and then you don't have much time to spend with family and then you just have limited time so don't mix up all these things and have at least one meal uh, as a family this i learned uh, recently uh, from an activity this is a, a very good point right one meal in a day and uh, have time you know if you are married uh, guys have some time to uh, talk to your spouse right by the end of the day do that and then have time to listen also <laughs> that is more important for men right and uh, have time to talk to your kids about their day you right? know if you are lucky if you are getting back home like 7 8 pm then spend some time with them what happened and all that and uh, these are basic things right but these days right with our fast paced life we miss all this right and then uh, at the night read books to your kids it's a great activity that you, you know you and your kid can build that bond together right these are some tips at home that you can follow so finally there right, are few things right see um, what i do is you know spend time with friends on a weekly basis that is important um, have few days in a year okay i have like in the december month few days for my friends okay uh, that you know we go out eat uh, and then spend some time all that and uh, you spend time with the nature you know go out spend some time with nature maybe as a spouse or with family or by yourself do it but with nature that's important right and uh, learn one new thing in a year it can be some special activities some music or some games or some like reading books or developing some habits learn one thing in a year new thing okay it's, that will give you really a freshness in your life right that is something and uh, with respect to money because see money is the most important thing which people when they mess up they mess up their life so for you to be happy right money wise um, you need to really take care of few things right this separate video you can listen to it and uh, for me right uh, see when you have good cash in your wallet you feel happy when you go out you are not worried so have some good cash in your wallet and have some good savings account um money in your savings account right some some money that you feel confidence uh, that that is something and avoid emis that's a uh, something that i always say avoid emis right see there are a lot of ted talks available on this topic being happy and then there are um, very good books being happy uh, how to be happy and all that uh, i'll put it in the descriptions definitely go through it and you can share your pointers your comments and in your life if you want to be happy how you are doing it on uh, in your personal circle so looking forward to see your comments i hope these pointers will help you have a great day